Hello saxophone players and welcome to the London Saxophone School. My name is Martino Scovacricchi and today I'm showing you the seven basic articulations. You can either play everything smooth and legato in the same blow without, without any tongue or you can chop it up and you can have everything short and staccato. The way you combine the two things, it creates patterns. You just want to have the basic ones because they're going to show up anyway in the music you play. That's the reason why you practice articulations. First articulation everything slurred, no tongue whatsoever. I'm gonna demonstrate on a simple two octave C major scale. So that's all slurred, all legato. Second articulation, everything staccato. Third, you have two legato and two staccato. And fourth, you have the reverse the pattern, you reverse it, and you have two staccato and two legato. Now, we're gonna have three legato and one staccato. Now reverse that pattern and have one staccato and three legato. The last one is the jazz articulation where you're tonguing on the off beats. And that's it. So those are the seven basic articulations that you need to practice with your scales, your intervals or thirds, fourths, fifths, sixths, whatever you're, you're playing at the moment. My advice is this, don't aim to practice all seven on every scale you do. Pick two, pick one even, and just stay on that for a few months until you master it, until you feel you're very, very comfortable. For example, pick uh, two legato and two staccato, and stay there for, for every scale you do, for every arpeggio you do, for every phrase or whatever you're doing, okay? And then move to the next one and start adding other articulations and, and you'll feel the difference. There's gonna be a massive improvement in your tongue and in your sound and your greater control of the whole, of the whole horn and instrument. Happy practice with this, this is a really important thing and look forward to seeing you again in the next video.